I typically get up sometime after five in the morning. I prepare lunches for my kids' school day, um, if my husband hasn't already, um, and start thinking about breakfast um, for the day and really start thinking about what I have on my agenda for that day and what I need to get done and what my must-dos are for that day. Um, typically, my calendar is pretty booked throughout the day. Um, and so I need to look at if there are things that I need to get done, do I need to make any adjustments with the calendar? After I drop my son off at his bus stop, um, I head into work. So I drop him off at about 7.20. And I like to get to work about an hour or so before anyone else gets there so that I have some time to do um, work before my meetings start. My meetings start at 9.00. Um, where I typically check in with staff, um, just a very brief check-in to address things that are coming up. Um, and then oftentimes I have meetings with partners, um, supporters, um, and by meetings, a lot of those meetings are actually over video. Um, so we do a lot of meetings over Zoom or Google Hangout or Meet, Google Meet. Um, and typically I'm in back-to-back -back meetings for um, most of the morning um, and sometimes into, into the afternoon. That's a typical day when I'm in the office. Honestly, I'm out of the office quite a bit. So I spend many days in Washington, D.C. Um, I also travel pretty regularly to Mexico um, to meet with our staff and allies there. Um, just this week I was in New York um, meeting with partners and other organizations with whom um, we're trying to advocate for advances and um, supports for migrant workers.